Hello guys and welcome to a new video. We're in the last day of season 1 and I believe tomorrow will be the start of season 2. So I wanted to post one final game before that. Today's game was a fun game. I had some really good fights from the start till the end. But as you can tell from the title, something went wrong. And it's the first time it happens to me. I wasn't really expecting that, but I learned my lesson. As for the guns that I'll be using in this game, a loadout Fennec for close range. And I didn't really get a chance to pick a second loadout. So I used a ground loot AK-47 for mid to long range. I hope you guys enjoy and let's get started. So today I'm landing in black market. I love this place as much as farm but I think it's better overall. You get more loot and you're guaranteed to have good fights almost every single game. And of course the fact that it has a helicopter and other vehicles vending machines which allows you to get to the next objectives much faster like upgrading and getting airdrops. So it's perfect if you're looking for action and kills. These guys seemed nice so I opened my mic and we had a small chat. They were saying GG and good fights so I told them that I'm leaving and they can tell their teammate to get their tags. Then I went to upgrade my class and I headed towards the airdrops and it was perfect because both airdrops were next to each other so I got some kinetic chills and I got my loadout fennec. After that I headed towards the second loadout airdrop but this time there was a squad waiting for me and it turned out to be the same squad I met on black market so we went in for round 2. I wanna take this chance to share a tip on choosing the best way to engage when you're against a full squad. Obviously the best is to land on a high ground and in here we had several options. So knowing that most of the enemies are located here near the airdrop, this house and this house would be a bad choice because I would be exposed to the enemy. So my best options were these two houses because in this house I can land on this side and use this cover to peek and shoot. Plus I have this zipline in case I wanted to bail. Just make sure you choose a house that has a cover facing the enemy. But anyway, I decided to go with this house instead as it was higher than the other one. In here I noticed that this enemy is alone, so it was my chance to go in and take him out. Oh. 
Engaging here was really bad because I left myself exposed to the enemies. Not just from one direction, but two. But I didn't really have any choice because I didn't have any hooks left. And if I had a hook available, I would have used it to switch to the church and attack from there. It would have been much easier. But anyway, things doesn't always go according to plan. Sometimes you find yourself in rough situations. But that doesn't mean you give up. Just do what you can. And most importantly, try not to panic. And whatever the outcome of the fight is, you will die in peace knowing that you did your best. After that, I went for the other loadout airdrop and again there was another squad waiting for me it's mostly the case in my server these days objectives are much harder to get Again, I had a chat with this squad and I told them that they can get the tags. Then I left towards sanitarium because I heard many shots coming from there. These guys were on voice communication and as I was trying to flank them here they saw me and they were pushing together so I had to find a way to split them and what I did is I jumped down using my wingsuit to make sure that they hear me going down then I used my hook to go back inside that way I managed to trick them into thinking that I'm still down there outside sanitarium so not only I managed to avoid getting pushed at once but I also succeeded in splitting them apart This was the same squad I met earlier and I was asking them not to shoot. At first they didn't shoot but I guess one of them wanted his revenge so bad. It was lame and honestly if he told me that he wanted to kill me I would have let him do it. But he decided to backstab me. Anyway today I learned my lesson not to trust anyone. Nevertheless it was a fun game with some good action and I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did a like would be highly appreciated. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next season. Peace.